Hey guys, my name is Zediac and welcome back to the Hotel Magnate here in Hotel Magnate. Because I am the Hotel Magnate right now. Guys, this potentially could be the last episode right now as we are currently in minus 66,000 big ones. We're going to hopefully now build all the remaining rooms that we currently have. Every single room is hopefully going to be a five star. I'm currently only making 2,500 from a room. But everything will change once I get the rest of them all in as you start playing around with prices. We're gonna get the spa in and we are gonna make some serious cash. We can have up to 22 rooms if I was charging 2,500 each. If I can work that out myself, that is 55,000 big ones every day. If my calculations are correct. But you know your boy's going to charge more than 2500 So guys, if you enjoyed this, if you have enjoyed this series, then please make sure you smash the like button down below. If you are new around here, then make sure you do subscribe so you are notified when more episodes and more series and more videos and more foolishness comes out in the future. But we got a lot of stuff that we kind of need to get done. So, what I'll do is I'll first sort out these five rooms here in a row. We'll get these five sorted first, because they're pretty much going to be identical to these rooms. Then, we'll get the spa done. Once I've got that done, we can then figure out how we're going to do these different size rooms. Now, these are going to be a lot different to these ones, so I need, you know, a little bit more brain power to work out how that is all going to go down. But these should be easy to do. We've currently got eight rooms all set up, so we get an additional five in, which will be 13, which is technically one more than we've ever have done before. I'm kind of excited. So... First things first then boys, first things first. We're going to designate this to be a bedroom. And then with the bedroom, we can go through everything. Now, it is a little bit long-winded, but we can definitely get it all done pretty quick. So actually, it's easier to do like this, isn't it? So duplicate. And I've got to remember all my spacings right now. You go there, then you go here. And then you go here. So that's the only one that is kind of the same. Oh, no, that's not the right. No, 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 Zodiac. Move. I've already messed it up big time. Right, you go here. You go here. You go there. Glorious. Right, get rid of that. So now we need to clone this. And we go wabam, wabam, wabam. It's like moments like this when you realize, yo, cynic, you place down so many freaking items right now. So many. Right, duplicate you. But we should simultaneously be able to get five rooms all done at once. Now that is what I call mama -ma magic <laughs> Right, let's, do <laughs> let's see the wardrobe next. I don't know what's going on right now. Duplicate. There. There, spin jitsu right round. There, there, and there. Glorious. So then the chair's just here. Now these should be pretty quick and easy and simple to get in. It's all pretty much in the same spacing. So, 13 rooms straight away. We're getting 37,500 a night if I can get them fully occupied. Damn. No, is it 37,500? 13 rooms? It is. No. No. It's 32,500. Seniac, get your math correct, boy. Oh my goodness me. What is this foolishness? Um, right, what are we missing here now? Right, right, right. Hold on, hold on. I've just realized we've got a wall decor in the... Oh, it's above the bed. That's what it is. I was thinking we, we have like decor. We got to squeeze him. But it all goes above the bed. Right there, there and there. Spin around. There, there and there. They're just them three. So we've done that then. Looking at this room. We've now got these. We got to squeeze him. So duplicate them. A little bit of wall decor. So just literally going to go bam, bam. Um, bam, bam, bam. Easy, mate. Easy. So now it's all about the coffee tables. <laughs> I told you about it. It's so long-winded. But once I've got these rooms in, 
then we're laughing all the way to the bank. And by laughing all the way to the bank, the bank is laughing all the way to my bank account right now because they're like, yo, Sinek, you owe us so much money. Please start repaying it before we go bankrupt. <laughs> Can you bankrupt the bank by borrowing too much money? Now that is a scary thought. So spin right round. We're almost done. There's only a few more items left to get in. So duplicate this. The desk is now going all in. Spin right round again. Have you ever seen a damn folio build so much so quick? No, you have not. I am like lightning, boys. Then finally customize it, the little mini fridge. Boom. 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 <laughs> so I think ultimately, is this now set to be a bedroom? Well, it does require an ensuite. Oh no, the rug. It's right in front of my face, the rug. How can I not get this in? Right, very loosely placed the rug. I'm not really caring about how I align this. And that should be everything. That low key should be everything now apart from the bathrooms. So the bathrooms then, we're going to duplicate this. They go right next to the door. So it's more like bam. Bam. Bam, bam. Well, bam. Then the actual bathtub itself, a duplicate, would go down here. So you would go there. So they kind of go opposite the door in a way. I think they do. I, this could be completely wrong. And now I've just come like, like messed everything up. No, but I think this is it. I think this is it, Chief. Right, okay, so duplicate you. So again, easy now because it's this case of bam. We're bam. Bam. We're bam. We're bam. And then the toilet, the poop hole. The last final bits, boys. And then we've got these five rooms all set up. I really wish you could duplicate. I bet your next update, they introduce duplication where you can duplicate a whole entire room. <sighs> and then I will be triggered. <laughs> so, we make this. Oh, this is the bedroom. We make this the ensuite. Is that bedroom now done? Yes, 2,500. And this becomes a bedroom. That becomes a ensuite. That is now a five star. Bedroom. It becomes an ensuite, that is five star. Bedroom, ensuite, that is five star. Bedroom, ensuite, that is five star. Got it. Nice! <laughs> so we've now got 13 rooms. If I can get them all fully loaded up, we're on to a good one. So last thing I'll do right now is the wallpaper. So we'll quickly finish off the bathrooms which we've gone for this kind of effect. Why can't I do the bathrooms? There we go. There we go. I might as well do all these bathrooms as well while I'm at here. Now, how much have I spent? I have now spent, I've got, I'm a, oh, I spent a hundred grand on those five, five rooms. A hundred grand on those five rooms. Jesus. Now, we don't need to do the flooring. The flooring's already in. We got a nice little kind of brownish carpet. <laughs> but we'll do the, uh, we'll get some patterns on the go for the rest of the rooms. We'll go funky. I'm trying to make, make sure I don't do, you know, sames, sames these wallpapers. Something a little bit different in every single room. You know, that, that would make it all look kind of nice. Ooh, that's a nice little pattern. So all different wallpaper. There we go. Everything's a bit, everyone's got a different experience slightly. So that's all in. We'll then do the spa next. So I'll, I'll have the door centralized. If I turn this into the spa, there is, oh, oh there's two, oh, mass, oh massage tables. Oh my goodness me. This place is luxury right now. If I go one. two three and then what's the issue do we need to okay how many staff can we hire 
Free staff for free massages. <laughs> we also need to get in the massage stand. Now, I don't really know how a massage room works because I've never actually been in one. So, I'm just going to do it like that. Build-wise, <sighs> when I think of massage, this massage spa, I'm thinking of log cabin like a sauna. I don't know why. Don't know why right now. But um, we're going to do said naturalness. What will look good? Oh, I like the idea of that kind of stone. Floor, natural. Is that too much, you reckon? I don't know if that's too much or not, but we'll see. They can have free massages. Not free, as in, like, they don't cost any money, but, like, free people at once. Glorious. Glorious, boys. So, we spend a little bit of time right now. We start chilling like a strawberry villain, and we wait for a few more guests to low-key arrive. Does anybody want to use the massage room yet? The spa? Because you can get some... Oh, there we go. Someone's using it. There we go. Someone's having a massage. Working on those glutes, I see. <laughs> Gluteus Maximus! Um, right, anyway. <laughs> people to stay in. I now got 10 people currently staying in the hotel. So while that happens then, we've got to figure out how are we going to manage to squeeze in five-star rooms and all the equipment all the jazz into this. Also, I'm, I've just realized I'm missing some windows. Oh, it's quite difficult to throw. You can't even throw a window in on them. So, some of them are windowless. There's more some time passes, the more and more we start paying off that debt. But it doesn't mean a thing right now because we're about to spend even more cash money, Moolah. So, I think what I'll do is I'll work with the smallest rooms first, which will be, to be honest with you, even that, you know, that is pretty much the same. Well, it'll be these two rooms because they're not as wide. They're, they're less by one. But, well, they feel like it anyway. Uh, but this is technically the smallest rooms. They have the smaller bathrooms, but these are the smallest rooms. How are we going to squeeze everything in here right now? We're going to try. So if I duplicate this bed. Oh, my goodness me. Shocking. Shocking. Okay, where do I take it? Do I pull it here? Do I put it right against there or down here? Or right behind... No, right behind the door because then we utilize that space. Actually, if I move it... Right, right to there. I might have to squeeze a little bedside table in. It means I get to use all of this wall and that wall there instead. Because you can't use that door anyway. So where's that little bedside table thing right now? Let's duplicate this. Duplicate. All right, there we go. Whack the lamp on it. This is going to be... If I can get this room working, then we are in for a real treat. Right, we'll go big objects first. So, oh, this is not going to work, is it? It's not going to work. So, right, okay, we'll set it to the bedroom. We'll set this to the, the ensuite. Just so we've got everything that requires. So a wardrobe, I can go for the big boy, five stars. I'm not going to be able to utilize this, am I? Right, if I put that there, apparently it's still usable. So now it just requires a desk. That is a four-star desk. There is no other four-star desks. Oh, there is. There's this one. Holy moly, that's huge. Okay. I could can't even throw that in. Can't even throw that in. Can I go, okay, I can go for this smaller one. If I put it right there as you walk in, sweet. So then for the next level, you require then a TV, which I could put the TV. Okay, so I get the four-star TV. Pull it there. Right. So we also require the facilities next. So let's sort this out then. So we'll go for the bath. Do you know what? The bathroom is quite large. That is actually the size of this bathroom, so we're kind of fine on this front. If I put that there, get the nice throne in. I feel like we've got more room. I don't know why. It just kind of feels like it, even though it's the same. So, that is the next level. A mini fridge, which I put right there, if it will allow me. Oh, no, we're auto-saving. 
We're all to save him, boys! Come on, come on. I feel like we could do something here. Did it go in? No. There we go. Okay, they can't get to the mini fridge. Now they can. So now we're missing a rug. I'll go for the big boy rug. So now they require <laughs> a couch, which I'm not going to be able to throw it in. Is this class as a couch? It is. Right, if I put it there. Right, can I move this over any more than what than it actually is? Right, move you there. Right, there's no way in this world I'm, I'm squeezing a coffee table in. There's no way in this world that I'm squeezing a coffee table in, guys. I'm just going to throw that out there right now. So, coffee table. So, the question would be then, what if I scrap this bed? So, if I sell, sold it, right, bed, and there's no... I could do a single four-star bed. But it requires a, a grade five bed. So I ain't doing it. And I ain't got any other grade fives, have I? There's not a grade five single. Damn it. That's how they get you, boys. That's how they get you in this game. So I can do the indoor plants. Which will be the thing on the wall. I could do the art piece. Which will be the bear head above the bed. It's just a coffee table. I'm slacking. Now, this room, I could definitely get it in. These what these two here might be the only four-star rooms that we have. Now, I'll try my best. But it ain't going in. That's too large. There's just nowhere for me to pull it. Unless I rearrange this. So if I put you over here. Put you over there. Move the TV just real quickly. Right. Put you. There. You. There. I'm going to see if it fits in first. Okay. Hang on. Television. Bam. Bam. Coffee table. Let's know I can squeeze it in. There's no way on this earth I could squeeze it in. Right, it goes there. No. They can't go to the bathroom. That's not a thing, right? No. Can I put the door there and they walk to the bathroom by going outside? Hmm. If somebody actually stops in there and it works, then at one, we've glitched the system. Right, I get some nice wallpaper in there right now. If that actually works, then hallelujah. I'm I'm flabbergasted, boys. What is going on? Right, she can actually she's in the bathroom. It actually works. We have broken the game. We have glitched the system. We have a plan of action right now. So, I could apply this to this room. It's not a problem. So, if I... Oh, no, no, let me cancel that. If I duplicated it and then literally got in this in every other room that we then have. So, for this one, it will be mimicked on the opposite side. This one don't matter because we can literally... We've got tons of space. These rooms are bigger than it. It's just a bathroom that I'm kind of slightly worried about. Now, if I duplicate the wardrobe, 
get it right up into the corner. I just realized I'm doing the whole thing backwards here, aren't I? Yeah. Is that going to work out for us? Probably not. Here it's fine, because the wall is just that long. That it don't matter. Um, now, we should still be okay. Oh, God, look at that room. Shocking. Seniac should be banned from building rooms. He should be banned from building rooms. Right, let's duplicate these. So this is fine in the big rooms. It's just this small room here. We've got to be a bit careful. Big rooms, it don't matter. We'll then do the bedside table next because this is mental. I bet you there'll be an update at some point where all my hard working goes out the window because they kind of fix. So you can't do it like this. I reckon that's what will happen. But we're on our way. Where there's a will, there's a way, boys. And trust me, I have the will to make it the way. What I don't have is the will to click on that um, lamp. <laughs> Duplicate. Right, there we go. Bam, bam, bam. So what are we now missing? We now need to do the desk. So I thought... I honestly thought, I honestly believed that we had to that we had to low-key have all the best items. But the game has fully lied to me. Right, this is the interesting one now. So we have to put this sideways in this room. All the other rooms, these don't matter because they can literally just go against this wall because of how long the wall is so we'll do the TVs real quick so bam 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 there we go little chairs at this even in the smallest rooms it's fancy <laughs> um, bam bam it's like I've given up on those big long rooms and the coffee tables this still blows my mind even to right now they can walk through coffee tables apparently this is basically what the game is telling us It's like, coffee table? Don't matter, mate. We'll walk through it. So, that's everything right now. We just got to do the wall decor. No, is it everything? Let me double check. Yeah, it's the wall decor we got to squeeze in next. So, bam, bam. Bam, bam. Bam. There's so much room left in them rooms. And then, obviously, above the beds... So, if this was a room, it would require a bathroom. <laughs> right now, it's time to do the bathrooms. So, this will be interesting in terms of this. Can I squeeze the shower there? The toilet, there, the sink, All right. Oh, no, no, wait, wait, no. the sink might be able to go here. If then the bath went there. <laughs> I don't know how this is even happening right now. I am, I don't know how I'm doing this. Okay, guys, I don't know how I'm managing to do this. 
but I'm doing it and people are going to love it. So this by the back of the door, by the back of the door. And then we duplicate this. So it's a case of there. For these, this is behind there. So spin. There we go. Great stuff. Duplicate. So first things first. It don't really matter there. Or there. All there because we have all the space in the world. Right, you're there. You're there. And then the showers, guys, and then we've officially done it. We've officially finished the hotel. I've just got to obviously. People are using these. Don't use them, they're not for you. Just got to get this last one in here that I've missed out. And it's a case of this needs the bathroom makes it oh oh I'm missing the rugs my bad makes this a five star bedroom bathroom oh I'm missing a sink in here Now a five star. <laughs> Even after all that, I'm still missing stuff. Five star. Five star. Five star. Five star. Five star. Five star. We done it. That dude is stuck. No, he's been fixed. 22 hotel rooms. I still got my calculations correct at the start of the episode, but actually right now, 22 means I'm charging 55,000 big ones a night. If I had full occupancy, though. If I had full occupancy. Occupancy. Interesting. Very, very, very interesting right now. Hmm. Hmm. So is this where we play around with the pricing? Manage hotel. Now, we are currently 84000 in debt. Surprising, considering we just spent all this money on this. But because we've had like a certain occupancy, it's been going slow and it's holding up. We keep making some sweet, sweet cash. So, in terms of the budget, if I go yesterday, we made a room income of 22500 It's only going to get bigger. <laughs> so, right, facilities. How do I sort out the whole rooms? Overview. I forgot how I did it. Pricing. Yeah, how do I do it? I, I've literally forgotten how I did it. Oh, room pricing's right here. So... If I charge... Four grand... They're now all four grand. Are we waiting for auto save? Or have I officially broken the game? Because they can't handle <laughs> the game crash. I lost everything. Nights. Up to the last auto save. Basically, I had to redo all of these rooms all over again. But it's okay. We finally got there. Before we do continue, I'm going to save the game right now. Oh my goodness, Space Eniac. Please save the game. Save this game right now. Please don't crash. Please don't crash on me. If the game crashes now, then I low key. No, no, we're okay. Okay, so if it crashes now, we're okay. We're okay. 
So, it's a play mode then. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Before I do put the rooms back up to, you know, whatever thousand. Oh, look at, the, look at this color. Yes, please. More of that color. Or that pattern, should I say. That looks pretty cool. I like this. I like this a lot. There we go. This is quite a fancy... These are quite fancy patterns, aren't they? I'm liking these patterns. So every room got a pattern. Every room legit now has a pattern. I feel like I want to add this to the reception area. Oh, that's the same pattern I've got going through the inside here. Nice. Right, anyway. I'm getting too carried away. So, if... Look at that. Now I'm in quarter of a million in debt. Because obviously I've, I've had the game pause because I thought we were going to crash again. But if I go to room pricing and I charge 4,000 big ones, this is where we it crashed last time. So, pricing on the room, 4,000 big ones. Oh, dear God. <laughs> do you know what, actually? Do you know what? Forget it. Forget it. 8,000. 8,000. If you're going to do it, go out in style. It's a five-star room. You want to rent a penthouse from your boy? They're pretty much houses. They're borderline apartments. All you're missing right now is a kitchen. But you got you got your own on-site chef. What more do you want right now? What more do you want? I don't know if the game is balanced yet. Because if we can, like, break the game in certain areas and whatnot, what makes you think that the pricing structure is balanced? I don't think it is. I reckon the, the the price imbalance structure is not balanced in the game yet. So we could charge 8000 for a hotel room. That's what I reckon. Right, there's new people coming into the hotel right now. And they are quite literally happy to pay the 8000 big ones. Now, we've only got 14 guests. Amazing. That, <laughs> that in itself is over a hundred grand. Oh my goodness, Ray! Right, okay. We'll do the marketing campaign very soon. We'll do the marketing campaign very soon. And uh, try and get a full a full load of people in. Macum maximum occupancy. So, with 22 rooms, 8,000 a pop. There's 160 plus another 16. 176. Wait, hold on. The orders give me 2,500. Why? The rooms don't cost this price. Are them people already staying in here before I change the price of the room? Is that what it is? Don't you lie to me, game. Don't you freaking lie to me right now. Well, right, we're going to manage anyway. Uh, yesterday, 25,000 we gave me profit. That's only 10 people, though. We had 14, so I don't think it's quite right just yet. They're the people who are still paying, you know, a certain price. Um, activate you. Try and get a full capacity right now. That is what we're aiming for. So only six guests in the whole hotel. Oh, maybe they don't like the eight grand price on a room. <laughs> right, let's see if these guys pay eight grand. Don't know if they're going to or not. I'm not quite sure. 2,500. What are they doing? Huh? Why are you not charging the, the... Can you not charge anymore? Are we going to save and reload the game? Do you know what? I'm going to save the game. We'll reload it just in case something is broken. Or do you reckon I've got to unassign and reassign the actual room? Because sometimes the game makes you do that. You got, the game broken half the time. You got to kind of wiggle your way through it sometimes. Ah. <sighs> 
Yeah. All right. Can I load? Load that bad boy. Load that puppy right now. And let's see if we can make that big one. If I can't, then fine. I can't scam anybody, can I? <laughs> we'll see what happens. Right, come on, folios. Load the game up for your boy. It's time to make a million dollars. All right, we'll fast forward him. So we've got a marketing campaign on the way. We are now only got six guests in, so maybe they are feeling the... I got the repercussion. Oh, no, lots of people are coming in. Lots of people are now coming. I got nine guests currently. They're not happy. A lot. Whoa, I'm getting. I'm, I think I'm getting some negative reviews. The quality apparently is down. Very, very low. What are they? Um, what are they saying? Um, nothing suitable is found in the restaurant menu. What do you mean? We got Jimbo's food delivery on the scene. Two guests. Two thousand. I don't know what's going on with these hotel prices, but now all of a sudden nobody wants to stay in your boy's hotel. So I'll bring it down to three grand. That's got to be reasonable, right? That has to be reasonable. Like, seriously, that has to be reasonable, guys. Because, you know, no one wants to stay at your boy's hotel anymore. What are you doing? All right, come on. Someone come in. It's the next day. Have I ultimately just broken my hotel? No, people are happy right now. There's more people coming in. Great stuff. Ten guests. Now, are these going to be charged three grand? Maybe the, maybe there is maybe this is balanced. Maybe the price and structure is low key balanced. Do you reckon the fact that I've added in more and more guests now the restaurant can't uphold it with the free waiting staff? Hmm. But let's see what this midnight brings. If it's two thousand five hundred and that's the max price you can get for them, then fine. It is what it is. There's not really much I can argue about. It's just then probably trying to get more, you know, maximum occupancy at this moment in time. No, okay. Well, we charge three grand then. So we can go to three grand. Do I push it even further? Why can't I get it to, okay, I can't get it bang on four grand. <laughs> the slider won't move perfectly. Damn. Damn. But more people are coming in right now. Make sure everyone's happy. 16 guests at this point. So that little campaign that we're doing. Uh, oh, no, it's not even active. Okay, activate it. There we go. Gain some more guests. So if this next day gives us the ability to have 4,000 almost per guest, I'll be walking away with 60 big ones. Oh, there's so many people in that restaurant. It's going to take a while for them to all get their food, aren't they? Oh, shit. I need to get more chefs. We need to work a little bit harder, boys. Some of them are going to be waiting so long right now. There we go. We're getting the big boy money. We are getting the big boy money. Not all of them paid the price, but I think some of them were paying the price of, you know, the 3,000 when they first came in. Five grand is what I'm pushing it up to right now. Glorious. Make me rich. <laughs> I sound so evil. He sounds so evil, boys. All right, people checking out. Oh. So someone came to check in, and then they didn't like it, and then they left. May, okay, well, 19 occupancy. Okay, th 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 there is a certain cutoff with this. 4,500 is what we'll push it to now. So 
So there is a balance. 4,000 they'll pay it, 5,000 they don't like it. So I've gone 4,500 in the middle. And see what we can get out of that. So midnight are coming. Cha-chinging for days. Someone paid five grand. Now only minus 68,000 in the bank. We could definitely turn a beautiful profit. Pennies are being made in the casino. Pennies are being made in the restaurante. I have made... Hopefully, a very successful business. Now, as we wait for more and more people to come in, budget on yesterday, 51000 for the rooms. Well, I'm keeping an eye on the uh, the happiness levels as people walk in. Oh, see, 4500 still might be pushing it slightly. Damn. So, we might have to bring that down a bit. Do you know what? Should we just go 4000 We'll keep it three nine nine zero, because then it feels like it's cheaper. But it ain't. Watch an extra tenner to make the number look smaller. You know what I mean? Right, this next day is about to end. We should get some stonks coming in again. Minus twenty nine thousand boys. Right. Okay. Okay. The woman in the casino has never left the building in how many years? Six years. <laughs> She's never going home. And now we wait. Now we continue to wait as new people do arrive. There's quite a few people. Not everyone's happy paying the price. But this might be enough for this day for us to officially turn a profit. And I say turn a profit, we are we already are turning a profit, but what I mean is get out of debt. I mean get out of debt, boys. This might be the day. 13 guests. Even at three grand each, 13 guests is enough to put us in the green. We've created a mean green killing machine right now. We ultimately have. We ultimately have. I'm just waiting and waiting and waiting until midnight strikes. And do we work away with the big money? 21 grand in the green. Holy moly, how much did we make on that previous day? 44 grand. So we make an average day profit of 40 grand. Damn, boys! All time. <laughs> All time, we've only just turned a profit. And that, guys, is how you create the most expensive and luxurious hotel the world has ever seen. We have officially milked this hotel dry. So until next time, I will see you all soon. So good. Bye.